Hello everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play Fiction Fixas Adventures in One. This is chapter two. When we last left off is the um, the one, two, three, four, five doors. And we're going with this door because we don't have any keys to the other doors. So it's definitely this door. And what we need to do is that we need to make sure we need to make sure that we wrote this is a puzzle and we need to rotate it in the right position which this one is easy to get harder once we progress oh and another thing is we need to get these gear pieces Oh my! Who is that? There he is! The Literati Agent! We meet again, Fiction Fixers. I see you're making some progress. Well, that stops right now. <laughs> Uh-oh. That strange man saw the signs. I couldn't possibly know which way to go. Well, Alice isn't going any further till we fix this. Yes. So let's see if we can find those signs. Okay. We also have, um, once again, the notebook. We also have the map here, which I forgot to show you. Okay, so the two things that we need is this earpiece and the map. The rest that we need to find is completely random. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh-huh, there it is. It's like one of these hidden object games where everything is randomized when it comes to the hidden object scene. However, the odds for this mission doesn't become too randomized, it remains the same while the rest of the items randomize. It's very hard to explain, but... Well, let's just say... Let's just say it's just... You know, something a bit different. We need to find the rest of the items, which makes things a little bit difficult. We need to. Unfortunately, I don't know where's that. Here's a seed, which is not what you think, like a card spade, but it's more likely a tool spade for gardening, I believe. Now I need to find one last coin. There it is. There's a hit. Now would be a good time to check the map. Click the map button. Okay. The blinking circle indicates your current location. The exclamation points indicate areas that currently require investigation. Sometimes backtracking will be necessary. We should expect to visit areas more than once. Let's close the map and check out those areas. Okay, sure thing. So let's go ahead and head on back. Uh, first thing that we need to do is that we need to go to this mouse hole and use this magnet. And we got ourselves a hammer. Amazing. And we need to go back. Sorry, this game is going to be freezing. It's going to keep doing that this whole time, is what I'm trying to say. And excuse the squeaking chair. Alright, so. We're going back down. We're going back down. No, no, no. That's not what I want to do. I'm supposed to go this way. Because there's a certain cabinet that we need to open. There's a certain cabinet... I can't even talk. There's a certain cabinet that we need to open. Ok, 
Okay, sorry about that. I gotta make sure that my microphone is loud enough so you can hear my voice. Okay, so... This is what we need to do. Let's open, and we have a sign. So we're going back the other way. So we can place the sign to the path. We cannot go the other way until, I, until we get the other sign, which won't be until later on in this game. Alright, so, zoom here. Then go here. So where are we headed? The White Rabbit's House. Oh no! Oh no! I'm late! But how late am I? My watch it appears to be broken. My whiskers, oh, if only I had the proper pieces, it could be fixed. Look, it's the white rabbit. Oh, we must help him fix his watch. So his watch is broken, which means we have to find the gear pieces. We also have to find some sort of key or something with the tool. Oh no! Oh no! I'm late! But how late am I? My watch it appears to be broken! My whiskers! Oh, if only I had the proper pieces, it could be fixed! Okay, so we need to have seven gear pieces. So, two, four, six. So, we're missing one more. Which means that... Which means that, um... And the pieces. Where did the other piece go? It's like I missed it. I could have easily put some of the gear pieces in, but I'm missing like one more. Alright, so we gotta we gotta find the missing gear piece. I know I pick up these two. See. See, the thing about this is that I have to do a lot of backtracking. Which I do not like because it's like, I'm trying to finish this LP. But it appears that I'm not going to get it done until I find the pieces that I'm missing. Otherwise, the game won't progress. Unlike point-and-click adventure games, this hidden object being apparently, um... Uh, you, you end up, like, using hints that could help you find what you're looking for, or what you're trying to progress. I don't know exactly where did the last piece was placed. It's like I'm missing something. 
but I don't know what it is of me. I don't know. I don't know where the rabbit put. Well, not the rabbit. I don't know where he left the thing. Oh, never mind. It's, it's already in my inventory. You've done it! You fixed my watch! Oh, my dear paws! Oh, my fur and whiskers, I'm late! She'll have me executed. I must hurry to the garden. Oh, Marianne, would you run in and fetch me a pair of gloves and a fan? Marianne? He took me for his housemaid. He'll be surprised when he finds out who I am. But I'd better take him his fan and gloves. If I can find them. Okay. And I think we need to go back to where we were in the beginning. Well, almost at the beginning. No, that's not it. Um, I'm supposed to do something here. I played this before, but I just keep forgetting of what it is. It's like I'm backtracking and it's like not clicking for me. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I probably have created an error, which, you know. How are we to get by with all these thick trees in the way? I what? Whoops, I didn't mean to click there. <sighs> Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Apparently, we need to clear up these paths that Alice cannot get to. So, this will trigger a hidden object scene, which is something that I was trying to do in the, um... in the beginning, but I just forgot what it was. Okay, so now, this is where we go back. Every time when I hear my dog shaking with with the collar and all, it makes me a bit nervous. He's alright though, but it's like when I'm trying to record, it's just just keeps me distracted from what I'm trying to do. Excuse me. Sorry for the sneeze, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I thought we got all of these the last time. Might as well clean them up, just to be safe. Mm-hmm. And we have another hidden object scene. This time, we need the soul. And the soul is exactly what we need in order to... in order to remove these branches. Alright, so, I'm just uh, getting the items. Uh, here's the shovel. Here's the nails. We only have two more. Now this is gets harder. There we go. And for this, I have spot that. This means we get to go back to the to the woods. For the woods. Do through this door oh here 
How are we to get by with all these trees in the way? I wonder if we can find something to cut them down. I was trying to zoom in, but I forgot I have to do this. Let's go here. Oh my! A giant puppy! I would love to play with him. If only I had a toy for him to chew on. Look at his fur. The poor thing is covered in bugs. Uh-oh. That's not good. And we need to get this. And do this. Now's our chance. Let's get some of those bugs off of him. Okay. In in this puzzle, I believe, what you do is click on the bugs until you get the amount that you're looking for. It doesn't matter what type. Ew! I've never seen so many bugs in my life! Wait, what is that in his fur? It's a rusty doorknob. And we also have the bugs. Which means that we're going to use it. Spider. We need to grab that key. What is this key? That for? was so gross! I can't believe you did that. I know. But we have to do what we have to do to complete the mission. Alright, we're still at chapter 2. Let's see. Yeah, this key goes to the... This key goes with this uh, toolbox here. And I forget the number. There's a code involved. So... Put the knobs in. And you oil... The, the knob, the doorknob. There you have it. Now, where can his gloves and fun be? Okay, so... Let's go here. And this is why I have to pay. So you go this And you find the code. It's 33454. And just to clarify... It's randomized. So the code is randomized. Look, what did Alice get into now? Uh-oh. I found another bottle. I wonder what this one will do. I know something interesting is bound to happen. Uh-oh. Not again. That's quite enough. I hope I don't grow anymore. I cannot get out of the door. Oh, I do wish I hadn't drunk quite so much. Alice has made a mess of this house. We need to find something to shrink her down, or we'll never get out of here. Probably a cupcake, perhaps? Well, we have to wait and see. Because first things first... It's first, though. Let's see, what we need from this hidden object scene. It's definitely ache. It is def well, it is ache. But also a hand clock. Do -do 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 -do. Sing along music, even though there's no lyrics. But that's besides the point. The point is, is we're trying to find an object. So that we can finish this chapter.
Alright, so here's the reddish. Here's the rabbit. Here's another tray. Okay, so we have three items that we need to look out for. Here's the zone needle. Where is the umbrella? A sash buckle. I don't know what that is. I think I do know what it is, but I don't know what it looks like, because I always forget what it looks like. Now I gotta use a hint. Wait a minute, that's the umbrella? That's the umbrella? I should have known. Now, there's this trick I discovered from Uncle Funk's videos. You go to the menu, then you click play again, and then you go back to the hidden object scene, and pull as quickly once you press the menu button. Sorry, my, my mouse is acting up. We can also go upstairs. And we're going to pick these up. And we have to get the shovel, but... That won't be until it is time to use the shovel. With the shovel. All right, hitting up, Dean. You need to get the magic key, the magical key, to be precise. And I do believe that this magical key will lead into the scene of the caterpillar. Once again, I have played this game, so I am fully aware. I am fully aware. Of what I need to do. Unless I have to backtrack, of course. Um. I need some marbles. There we go. And here's a spyglass, which is that small letter opener. Um, we also need to search for a wooden block, which is this one. And finally, we need to search for the candlestick, which I'm going to use a hint for that. Alright, so we got the magical key. This means that I can use the cupcake. If I eat this cake, it's sure to make some change in my size. Hopefully it will bring me down to the proper size. Dear me, am I back to normal now? It's becoming hard to tell. Alright, so next thing we need to do, we need to go outside. And before leaving um, this uh, area, we need to give the fan and gloves to the white rabbit. Marianne, wait, wait! You're not Marianne. Thank you, kind girl. No, sir, I am not Marianne, but you are welcome. Dear me, I'm late! I must be off to the Queen before it's off with my head! Wait, excuse me, sir. Which way is it to the Queen's garden? Oh, he's already gone. We must find him. All right. Never fear, Alice. We're coming to find the White Rabbit. Alright, and that will be the end of Chapter 2. Stay tuned for Chapter 3. I believe that this next door over here will lead to a very difficult puzzle. It's going to lead to a very difficult puzzle. I will know for certain that this is the chapter I'm working with. So, that's it for Chapter 2, ladies and gentlemen. Stay tuned for Chapter 3.